A very good morning, everyone. Welcome back to our daily devotion insight. Today, we'll share with your devotion entitled "A Journey of Love." A journey of love. Second Corinthians five nine says, "Therefore, we make it our aim or goal, whether present or absent, to be well pleasing to Him." It is no surprise that the Apostle Paul used marriage to illustrate the bond between Christ and His Church in Ephesians two twenty two to thirty three. The most basic explanation is because both are based on a relationship. Just as saying "I do" at the altar is only the beginning in a marriage, saying "I believe." In Christ, is only the beginning. That relationship as well. Married couples will agree, marriage is never ending. is a never ending journey. Couples spend a lifetime plumbing the depths of a spouse' life and personality. True love means always seeking to love. A spouse better and more deeply every day. Likewise, entering into a relationship with Christ means the same: spending a lifetime getting to know Jesus and learning to love Him better and more deeply. Just as spouse spouses seek to demonstrate their love for one another. So we pursue an even deeper knowledge on how to please the One who died and now lives for us and in us. Long loving for a lifetime is a daily journey. Think of ways you can show your love for Christ today, in your thoughts, in your words, as well as in your deeds. Amen. So it's a lifetime journey in loving Jesus and obeying Him and walking with Him daily. Charles Bridges says, "The child of God has only one dread: to offend his father. The child of God has only one desire: to please and delight Him." Amen. Life with Jesus, loving God, is a life journey. God bless you and have a great day. Father, bless your people with a great day. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. God bless.